In this episode, last stand, bag him and tag him, down to the last round, in the nick of time. This guy and his mates are all what was left of the entire enemy team, believe me or not. But they did not panic, not in the slightest. Instead, they mustered all of their courage and decided to stand to the very end, trying to destroy as many enemies as possible. The foe foolishly believed that the victory was in their grasp and rushed in one by one, eager to win, but ultimately perishing in total vain at the hands of the deadly duo. Boy oh boy, all you have to do to win is regroup and attack together. This is yet another example that a well-organized team, even small, can do a whole lot more than a large herd of cats. May Lavo, please enjoy your 1000 gold for this glorious moment. Some people believe that pure melee or close-range builds have more setbacks than actual advantages. They say that fighting at range is best and no amount of adrenaline from going up close and personal can't help it. Whatever, the author of this video is here to prove them wrong. He acts efficiently and fast. What's that? Destroy a couple of rides while being under a rocket barrage? Easy. Huh? Demolish a couple of heavies into scrap? No problem. Let the crowd say whatever they say, sitting on their sniper porches. Their turn will come soon enough. Thanks for a great video, Speed Demon. Your prize gold is inbound. It's not easy making a living out in the wastes when you're a raider. More often than not, you must carefully manage your resources, especially when it comes to ammo. The driver of this ride have calculated correctly that his grenade launcher will have just enough ammo to win this fight, barely. But that's enough for a real warrior of the waste, right? Would you look at that? As the enemy team shrinks down to one less guy, our hero is left with just 32 grenades. 8 grenades to disarm the foe, 20 more to immobilize. Okay, that leaves us with 4 grenades. 3, 2, 1, yes! I told you it would be enough. Barely. That's some great math and combat accuracy you have, Sergey. Here's your world earned prize. Good job. As we all know, time is a precious matter and its proper management can sometimes decide the outcome of a battle. This video is a great demonstration of this concept. The capture is almost complete and the battle can be considered a full victory for the enemy, but a lone and brave rider jumps into the capture ring and stalls the timer. Despite the punishing fire of the enemy, the ultimate sacrifice proves just enough to save the day. This high adrenaline battle that turned an almost guaranteed defeat into a glorious victory cannot be ignored. Knowing when to enter the fray is a rare gift, Commander Bubbles. Use it wisely. Also, use these 1000 gold coins wisely, please. Now it's time to pick the best comment of the past week. Cynical and Salty says, I scream, you scream. Oh wait, only you will be screaming. Please respond to your original comment with your in-game nickname and email address so we can send you your prize. Please be advised that the prize may take up to 5 business days to be added to your in-game account. Thank you for watching this episode. Okay, let's recap the three simple steps on how to submit your video to Crossout Shell. Step 1. Record and put together a video. Attention! The submitted video must be made by you, must be published for the first time, must have public access for viewers, and must not violate any copyright laws. Step 2. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the like button below this video. Step 3. Upload your video to YouTube and send us a direct link to Crossout Show at Gaijin.ru. The covering email should contain the desired category for your video, your in-game nickname, and the email address registered with your game account, so we can send you the reward should your submission win. Every week, four submissions will win 1000 gold. We will also be awarding the best comment of the week with 300 gold. So, get your engines revving, make some content, send it to us, or simply watch and comment. Either way, we got plenty of gold to go around. See you in the week.